It's not that good. But this is, we're in Hawaii. We are here for about three or four days. Um, we're here for four nights? Four nights, yeah. We're here for four nights through Sunday. Yesterday was our travel day. Uh, I didn't take much video of that, but you get the idea. We went on the plane, went and then boom, we were here. Uh, we got off, got some food to eat last night, checked into the Hyatt Regency in Waikiki Beach. The water is beautiful. We're sitting on the 33rd floor, and from everything I can see, this property has got it going on. Let me give you a quick tour. Now, obviously, the view is the highlight of the room, and you do have a pretty nice balcony out here with a little seating area if you want to hang out, enjoy your little coffee machine that they give you in the room, which I expect a little bit better, Hyatt, come on. But uh, they do be having a nice bathroom area, cool vanity area with the sinks, standard pretty much tub. They did have a bidet in there. I'm not gonna show you that, but I'll give you a little quick peek of the remote. They got all these little functions. They got user one and two, they got a little bottom wash, and they got every mode. So obviously I'm not gonna show you the in-use portion of that, but you get the idea. It is pretty nice. I have not seen that at a Hyatt before. Uh, there's a nice long desk area here for you to like store crap. And uh, they got pretty nice TV. Not that you're really gonna be using it while you're in Hawaii, but uh, it's here. They got the mini fridge in here, pretty much standard. They did throw in a few couple small extras for us. Uh, they have these like reusable water bottles, which is cool, you know, saving the turtles out here because we're in Hawaii. Uh, they got this sweet lamp. I really like this lamp. I, I wanna take it low key. Uh, and then they also do have uh, some chocolates that they put on the bed for us when we first walked in. Uh, that was nice, we kind of ate those already, but uh, I don't know, if I can find a photo, I'll put it in. As I give you a tour of the amenities, I'm also gonna go ahead and get in the gym. I don't really feel like going right now, but we're still gonna do it. We're gonna get after it, get a good 30 minutes in, and we'll show you around. One hour later. Okay, I did my best to get some clips at the gym, but um, I'll have to probably go back because it was pretty full this morning, surprisingly, and uh, I don't want to make anybody feel uncomfortable by filming in there. So uh, we'll go back in there. There's a good amount of equipment, Smith machine, cable pull downs, almost everything you need to get a good workout in um, if you're trying to do weights. There's also Peloton bikes as well as um, tons of stuff for cardio if that's what you're trying to do. And I think that if you're coming to the hotel and trying to get a workout in, it's going to have basically everything you need. The pool area is really nice. So there's two towers that separate the pools and you can be in either building. Um, it's kind of small relatively to I think a lot of other Hyatt pools, but it's so close to the beach that I think most people are probably just going to the beach. Um, there's a nice sized hot tub as well for the evening times with a bar right by it. So no complaints. There's a main atrium with a koi pond and basically a ton of different shops. There's three ABC stores within the building itself. Uh, so you're going to be at no loss to find anything you're looking for if you forgot anything on your trip. I believe our plan for the day is to go see the Pearl Harbor Museum, which I think should be pretty cool. I've never seen that before. Um, and then we're going to try to get some breakfast along the way. That spot was really good. Uh, we got a ton of things. I'll put in a clip of what we got. But we had um, the amazing pancakes. We also had their uh, ribeye hash. Can't recommend enough. It's kind of a small local spot. Don't think you're gonna find it if you were just doing touristy type breakfast places near the hotels. Um, but I'll put this place up on the screen. It was awesome. Has really good reviews on Yelp. And uh, yeah, I would definitely recommend. We also managed to kind of look out at the car rental place. Uh, I got upgraded to the SRT Hemi on the uh, Dodge Durango. So don't know if it's to be believed, but I've checked the data log because I'm a nerd and there's a 288 zero to 60 on there. Don't know if that's with a, uh, a rollout or it's on a prepped or unprepped surface, but somebody had a good time in this thing.
Not sure it's getting better than this. We're sitting on Waikiki Beach right now, just in front of the Hyatt. It is beautiful. The water is about 75 degrees and you have a very clear blue. Um, we had a couple cocktails up at the uh, hotel bar at the Hyatt. Earlier we saw the Pearl Harbor Museum. It was awesome, but really uh, interesting to see and uh, definitely a very memorable site. Um, and then we also checked out on the way back a couple sites, um, but I didn't take any recordings there, but it was very cool. One hour later. <laughs> my bad, my bad. Hello. <laughs> Is it time for Christina's Corner? I think it could be. Hey, everybody. It's time for Christina's Corner. I see why <laughs> Matt likes doing this so much. Uh, we are on the beautiful island of Oahu. Uh, we had our first full day here today. We had some really great food. I think it was... Maybe what was the name of the restaurant? Okay. We're about to go to Tommy Bahama's Marlin Bar. It's kind of a little bit of a fan favorite for us. We used to check it out on Maui and we've been to it in Palm Springs. So we thought we'd have to go today and we're gonna show my parents. And then tomorrow we're gonna drive through the island, see if we can find some really awesome fruit stands and take you along. So stay tuned. And the shout out is to Alex Myers, Matt's newest fan. If I don't close it out tonight, we'll see you tomorrow. I'll take some clips of the Tom Bahama Marlin Bar tonight for some food. And uh, if you haven't already, like, subscribe, do it down below. You know what to do. We'll see you tomorrow. Would you like to update the block on your crankiness? I'll kill you. Good morning, everybody. Uh, it's now Friday. We're here for two more days. So we got another 48 hours to make the most of being on Oahu. We're gonna try to go up to the North Shore today and see what we can find up there. Um, I'm sure we'll run into uh, a few things along the way is what we're hoping for. We might try the Dole Plantation out, uh, maybe some food trucks. Um, right now we're gonna try to find somewhere for breakfast, so I'll update you guys on what we find. Um, otherwise, it's looking good. It's a little bit more uh, cloudy today than yesterday. I don't know if I can play out of here. Hold on. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so it's a little more cloudy than yesterday. Um, not as sunny, but hopefully that'll break. It's only about 9 a.m. right now, so we're hoping maybe as it uh, gets later in the day, the sun will come out. Um, but otherwise, uh, things are looking good and we're excited to get to the North Shore. Yeah, cool. Okay, we just wrapped up at the North Shore. Um, we kind of just wandered around a bit trying to find a place where we could park and end up on a beach. Uh, I don't know exactly where we ended up. Let me put it here on the map and I'll go back and figure it out later on. It was a ton of fun. There was some snorkeling to do with some fishes and stuff. Um, we got to see uh, a lot of cool like tide breaks out here. And then we went to a uh, shrimp and taco truck. Really good. Uh, now we're gonna head back. 2,000 years later. <laughs>
Good morning, everybody. It's uh, our last full day here on the island of Oahu. We're headed back tomorrow night. Um, so I'm going to try to do one hike before we go because we thought that it was going to be worth seeing at least one hike. Um, I was just looking up a few of them. I saw the Stairway to Heaven, which looks like it's the old Spinebreaker 9000 for me to get up. Uh, so I think we're going to go ahead and do Diamond Head Trail, which is an easier rated hike. Uh, which is all we're really looking to do. No one's looking out here to, to start doing Mount Everest. We're just trying to uh, maybe get a cool view. Otherwise, uh, last night we did Herring Bone for dinner. That was excellent. I'll put that right here. We initially tried to go to a, another restaurant first, but uh, glad we ended up on Herring Bone because uh, the food was awesome. Okay. What's up guys, we are back from a hike. We initially tried to do the uh, Diamond Head Trail, but turns out that guy needs uh, reservations in advance and it was full today, did not know that. So we did divert to a waterfall hike called the Moana Falls hike. Put that up here, it ended up being pretty fun. It only took about an hour round trip, but uh, it was kind of fun to hike up. It got uh, a little rainy, so we got muddy, had to come back, do a little quick rinse. But uh, now we're back up and running again. We checked out Sweet Ease Cafe this morning. Quick service, really in and out, like 15, 20 minutes to get food. It was uh, an excellent experience and pretty good food for what it was. Uh, we checked out uh, like three local spots. Again, I'll put them all on the screen. Uh, they, were, they were all pretty good. We've done a good job of not just eating at the hotel on this trip and, and trying to check out some local spots. Um, rest of the day today, I don't know, it's our last full day, so we may try to go back to Foodland because it's been one of our favorite staples of Hawaii on both trips. And uh, I don't know, maybe check out the beach one more time, we'll see. Yo, look at this big boat. Look at this big boat. CMA CGM. What is that? Don't know, but it's a big boat. A big ass boat. Guys, thanks for watching. Um, we're about to head out to the airport. Maybe I'll take some closing shots, but uh, like, subscribe, comment down below. We appreciate you guys watching and we hope you enjoyed this one. Next one coming up later this year is Tokyo, Japan. So we'll see you then.